foremost teams in Spanish football, Real Madrid and Barcelona, and they're getting ready to face each other here at the Bernabeu. My name's Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary is Stuart Robson. Stuart, can't wait for this one. No, nor can I, Derek. They don't come any bigger than this, do they? The two giants of Spanish football. The atmosphere is incredible inside this stadium. Let's hope we see a top-class game as well. begins in goal. Nacho Fernandez plays with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Federico Valverde plays with Vinicius Jr. in the wide areas. And operating through the middle in attack today, Karim Benzema. And the Barcelona shake looks like this. Marc-André Ter Stegen stands between the posts. Frenkie de Jong plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And they kick off here. Did have the ball, but not anymore. Sergio Busquets. Kessier. Frankie de Jong. A free kick decision goes the way of Barcelona. And space for the cross. And crossed in there. Well, no problems defensively. And plenty of room in the wide area. Benzema. Camavinga. Benzema! And putting his body on the line. So it's going to be a goal kick here. Kessie and Real with the ball again. Rudiger, the ball with Luka Modric. Rudiger has it. On the ball, Rudiger. Modric. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. Firing it in. And up for grabs off the keeper. Corner given to Real Madrid. Fired over by Kroos. And clears the danger. 
Barcelona free kick it'll be here Marcos Alonso. Rudiger. Kamavinga. Tony Kroos. Modric. Eduardo Kamavinga. Well read to ease the pressure. Federico Valverde. A oh, lovely incisive pass. Defensive excellence there. with the corner and still dangerous not all that hard to deal with crosses like that not a successful intervention winning the ball back Rudiger Is with Vinicius Junior. Now the electronic board showing one additional minute. Rafinha. And the first half is in the history books here at the Bernabeu. Well, give us your critique, Stuart, on Karim Benzema. Will he be a bit disappointed with himself? anticipated plenty of talking points so far and now the second half is underway a fine reading of the situation Valverde. This is Kroos. Tony Kroos. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Well, it was a good looking sequence, but it comes to an end. He's taken on his opponent here. Well, he couldn't worry the keeper with that effort. Federico Valverde on the ball Rudiger Tony Kroos Modric giving the ball away 30 minutes left for play Rafinha setting off perhaps a little bit too much here in the opinion of the referee now what can they do from this free kick situation well Real Madrid are going to make the change now firing it towards goal 
Well, the free kick fired too close to the goalkeeper. Well, there you have it. They haven't been good enough going forward. They've created very little so far. They need to play with much more urgency. Chouameni. And after the cross, a tremendous block. Advantage, Barcelona. 20 minutes to go. Delightful pass. Well, they know they need to stop him. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Karim Benzema. It's with Vinicius Junior. Clear foul, but a Real Madrid advantage. Eder Militao. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just wasn't a very good pass, finally. Kessier. Barcelona on the front foot in anticipation of scoring the winner. And they deal with the threat this time. Busquets. A very effective challenge put in. An attack full of promise. De Jong. Making progress. De Jong. And blocked for now. Well, these Real fans believe they're still... Now, far from a smooth challenge. Now, will the referee produce a card? So, a personnel change, then. De Jong, and an effective clearance. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Must take the lead here. Keeper did his job to begin with. Oh, a goal! And is that going to be the one that wins it for them? There's every chance, and the fans are lapping this up. Well, here's the replay. Yes, it's a decent shot, but the goalkeeper has to do a lot better there. He's parried it out into a dangerous area, and suddenly the ball's in the back of his net. It's poor goalkeeping, you have to say. and not to be for Real Madrid they have to accept defeat what did you think of their performance as a whole well Derek not quite good enough today yes they only lost by one goal but I never felt they were in control of the game a frustrating day all round for the coach to think about for the next time well as we run the rule over this man's work positive after positive Stuart well I thought he had a good all-round performance today